Hello, welcome to the news. Welcome back with us once again. I hope you had a fantastic week. We had a pretty good week here. We had a tournament, all kinds of stuff, and let's get into the new releases because uh, this week's going to be kind of spicy. Great news for AOS players as Seraphon is coming out with a lot of new stuff. But first up, Seraphon Battle Tome. Coming as both standard and a gold foiled special edition, these would be great to pick up as, well, it looks like Seraphon's going to get a lot of love this time. I tell you what, there's some really cool models. Uh, I don't oh, play yes. Seraphon, but I'm buying the models just because they look amazing. Oh, yeah. Speaking of, the Slan Star Master. This fantastic new chubby boy is all new designed, has all kinds of new stuff on his base, and he's a star master and, you know, head of the army. So if you want to zap your foes, definitely jump into this guy. Yeah, and I love it's got a kind of a, I love the Aztec feel. I know that's all they've always been Aztec, but mm -hmm. I think the the throne looks really cool. Yes, El Throno, El Chapo. Yes, that up we got the Skink Star Seeker. Or Star Seer, if you want to say it correctly. If if you want to say it. I, yeah. Words are hard. Yes. Either way, this is the most powerful of the wizards uh, floating in on just a beautiful, beautiful mount or throne, I should say. Yeah, it's a throne. Yeah, that that's the thing is like all these, the wizards of the Saurus, they're all floating around on thrones yes. and stuff. And it, it's well, so cool. Well, when I looked at it at first, I thought it was kind of techno-y, but then mm. I got a closer look. I'm like, no, that's just really decorated rock. This yeah. is just Awesome. Well, they call it jade. It's like jade rock yeah. and stuff. But, but following right alongside that, and I'm actually excited for this guy. Oh yes, is the Saurus Scar Veteran on Agradon. If you want to charge into battle and slaughter your enemies while looking fan freaking tabulous mm -hmm. doing it, you need this guy because this model looks bloody amazing that is the most brutal looking mount i've seen in a while yeah it looks it just looks awesome yeah i mean honestly like this refresh is so great mm -hmm. it's so great and they look so good and i'm excited yeah it looks i'm really excited well every model so far looks great yeah yeah speaking of great looking models saurus astrolith bearer this source marches into combat bearing the astrolith, which will buff all nearby units. I want his hat. Yes. I, I The model looks great. No, the model looks amazing, <laughs> but I want his hat. Yeah, I want his staff. That looks weird and crazy. I love the yeah, electricity. Yeah. I mean... He buffs all his units, so if you're gonna if you're gonna start this army, you I think you're gonna need this guy. Yeah, hundred percent. But let's not forget the Agradon Lancers. These fantastic new models can either be ridden by Saurus or Saurus champions. And again, the Agradons look amazing. Oh yes, they look great. I love the I don't know, just something about the redesign. It looks awesome. Well, the thing is is the old Saurus the the cold ones mm -hmm. looked awful. Let's just be honest. I'm just throwing that out there. They look bad. Then Dark Elves got their refresh and got their cold ones. They looked amazing. But these take the cake. That that's why you're so so hard up on this cold ones. Yeah. Yeah. You want, you want your elves back. Well, I mean, yeah, eventually, but you know, right <laughs> now Saurus cuz they're really cool right now. Yes, they all look great. But if you want to smash the enemy, Croxagors. Rawr. <laughs> Marching into the battle, the biggest of the Seraphon and intimidating Croxagors smash everything in their path. Yeah, with big sticks with things on it. Yes, big mallets. Bladed mallets. Dude. <laughs> it's more of an axe. Well, it, it's like a big bone on the end with spikes on oh, it. Oh, yeah. It's yeah. It, just... Because, you know... Destroy everything. Gotta go with that primal look. Oh, yes. But let's not leave the skinky boys out. Ooh. The Raptodon Hunters. Well, just like my mother used to say, skinks are people, too. So, if we need them mounted, let's put them on a dinosaur. With a mohawk... With that can throw javelins or lances. Yes, these 
they look awesome. I just love, they look ridiculous, but in the perfect and best way. Hey, skinks are people too, okay? Mm, true. But if you're looking to fill out your army, Source Warriors. Filling the ranks is your main troop choice. The Source Warriors are a great, solid go. I mean, can't go wrong with a bunch of angry lizards. Yeah, and again, the redesign looks amazing. Mm -hmm. I, I love the models. I think they did a really good job on all of them. Oh, yeah. And, yeah, I mean, but what more is there to say other than, you know, teeth and spears and shields? Yep, just mess everything up. Yeah, <laughs> but... You want to reinforce that with something a little bit spicier? Ooh. Let's try the spawn of Kotek. Yeah. So, going on a little reminiscence here, this was actually my very first Warhammer model that I bought. Yeah, you have the metal version. I do, but, you know, that way it was called something completely different back then. But this new redesign looks amazing. Mm -hmm. I'm going to have to buy it just because it brings me, well, memories from my very first model ever that I bought for Warhammer. And if it's anything like the Skaven, fire is your friend. I love fire. Fire is great. Also in the game, it's pretty cool, too. Oh, yeah, true. Moving on to Asmodee. Wow. First up for Asmodee, we do got to backtrack a little bit because two squadrons came out, the Imperial and Alliance Squadron for X-Wing. And these are entire armies in a box. Yes. So you want to jump right into X-Wing? These are a perfect way to do it. Yep. It comes with all your essentials, your cards, your uh, cardboard, all that. And fantastically painted ships. Yeah, comes pre-painted and all ready mm -hmm. to go. Yeah. But moving on to the big news, the big event, the big Lebowski, Shatterpoint, Ooh. which will be out this week. So make sure to pre-order. Actually, it'll be next week. Listen. June 2nd, whatever when, day that Whenever the on. things happen. Yeah, that, that's <laughs> when it's going to be. But Shatterpoint is coming, and we are going to be demoing it soon. Yes, and these are, uh, I do love the scale. They're a little bit bigger than your, uh, they're not 28 mil. Yeah. And I, they look really easy to paint. Yes, yeah, I the detail on them are amazing. Um, mm -hmm. They are actually, listen, Games Workshop, better watch out, because people are catching up. Yeah, they look great. Very detailed. Yes, yeah, and I am super excited about this game because Marvel Crisis Protocol has been real big here. Yes. And this is basically Star Wars version of Marvel Crisis Protocol, skirmish game. Star Rules Wars Rules are Protocol? different. Star Protocol. Star Protocol. Yeah, yeah, Firefly. Um, but, yeah, <laughs> so we're going to be demoing it, like I said. Uh, make sure to pre-order. Um, this first wave we're going to be limited on, so we're not going to be getting the full... Six packs of each and, and all that stuff. But core boxes, we have plenty. We'll have all of them. So yes. if you pre-ordered, we got your core box here. But they do have other boxes coming out. Yeah. And first up, twice the pride, double the fall. The Count Dooku squad pack comes with Dooku, Magna Guard, and Jango Fett. Yep. And yep. I'm pretty excited about that because uh, Mandalorian all the way. Yep. Uh, as you know me, Separatists all the way. So I'm really excited about this pack. I'm glad to see some Magna Guard. Yeah, and and the models look so good. Oh yeah, I, I want to see what Dooku looks like. Yeah, I mean we got we we broke out the core, and I was looking at the different droids, and I was looking at Asajj, and like it just they look cool. So. Yeah, yeah, I'm super excited about Ooh, this I game. I wonder what Jango's gonna look like. I bet Jango's gonna look awesome. He probably looks like a Mandalorian. Well, you know what I mean. Anyways. But moving on. Hello there, General Kenobi. In this squad pack, you're going to get General Obi-Wan Kenobi, his loyal Commander Cody, and reinforcements of the 212th, Waxer and Boyle, if you choose. Yeah, these these models look great, and i got to admit, Kenobi looks awesome. Yeah, oh yeah, his classic stance, ready to be the perfect defense in battle. Can't wait till uh, Grievous comes out and we can have a proper battle. Well, while the real men talk, if you want to come play this game, definitely come in and do that. Yeah, we're going to be demoing it uh, this weekend or next. I hope this weekend. Uh, yeah, I gotta get. I got a lot of painting to do. Yeah, and I gotta pick up them droids and actually help you out. Yes. Yeah. Ideally. But that's not all. We also have terrain coming out as well. We have two separate packs: the high ground and take cover packs. Not much to say here, as it's terrain and it's sized for the uh, new new scale for the shatter point. But yeah, looks good and. Yeah. Great. It won't cost you an arm and a leg either. But 
we can't mention, we can't forget to mention measuring tools and dice yes. are coming out as well. So it's all dropping all at once, and it's going to be so much fun. Yeah, because you, you require special dice for this game. Yes, yeah, it's just like Marvel Crisis Protocol, other than uh, you have two sets of different dice for this one. So mm. pretty exciting. But I think that wraps us up for Asmodee, so let's jump right on into events. News. Well, starting off Friday, we have Magic Friday, or Commander Friday, or Oathbreaker Friday, or Planes Chase Friday. Whichever one you decide. Just magic. <laughs> magic Friday. Um, with that, we move on to Asmodee Saturday. Uh, we say Asmodee Saturday because we got Crisis Protocol going mm -hmm. on. We're going to have Shatterpoint coming up soon. We have Legion, all of the goodness. All but of the things. All of the stuff, all of the time. Yes. But moving on, we have regular Warhammer Sunday this Sunday, uh, as we did have a tournament last week. And yeah, so if you uh, would like to see more tournaments on other things other than, you know, Warhammer. We did push Legion the week before that. Mm -hmm. We had a tournament, which stay tuned because we're going to have another Legion tournament. And if you would like to see tournaments in other things, maybe things we've never even heard of, yep. definitely let us know. Put it down in the comments. Well, we, I would like to touch on that uh, during the tournament that we did have Bolt Action come in. Yes, yeah, which is pretty exciting. Uh, it's a game that I have been wanting to get into for a very long time. Now, we're not sure if we can order it yet. Not as of yet. Uh, that's something that I'm going to have to dig into, but if we can, we will be selling Bolt Action because, well, yes. it, it's awesome. It's a game with tanks. What's not to like? So if you're a Bolt Action player, we actually have a, we're starting to try and develop a little community here of that, yeah. too. So come on in sometime. Let us know what's going on and let us know. Who you run with? Where are we at, Wes? Two hundred one South First, Ponca City, Oklahoma. So come on in and uh, yeah, come see us. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell. Follow us on all of our social medias. I cannot talk today. Mm. Follow us on all of our social medias: Facebook, YouTube. Yeah. Find us on TikTok, uh, Instagram. We're all over the place right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. And uh, hopefully soon uh, we'll get back in the rhythm of doing the podcast again. Yeah, we, yeah, you were gone and I got sick. And I, you left me here with Mikey. That's true. That is true. That's almost a cruel and unusual punishment. <laughs> but, yeah, if you want to come in, play a board game, whatever, um, yeah, come on in. We would love to see you. And also, we're going to do it the proper way this time. Roll some dice! That was actually refreshing from what happened last time. Yeah, it was pretty bad. Love you from the guild. Love you. Stop it! It's all of our things now! No, it's my thing! <laughs>